far off the 30 degrees Celsius mark, mid 80s Fahrenheit, has been somewhat cooler in the more western and northern areas. That's because there's been a good deal of cloud there, and not only cloud, some showery outbreaks of rain as well. Down to the south of us, though, over France, we have fairly clear skies, and temperatures there have been even higher. But our cloud is giving some outbreaks of rain at the moment, and some of that rain, incidentally, quite heavy and thundery. In fact, we've got some flashes of lightning occurring at the moment, more particularly across the more northern parts of England. So obviously quite a variation around at the moment. But these warm southerly winds are still with us, coming up from France, and they're going to be there tomorrow, although things will change, as we'll see in a minute, later on. But for this evening, many places cloudy. These outbreaks of, in places, heavy and thundery rain, although I think the southeastern corner probably will escape most of it. And then the more persistent rain tending to work its way away northwards during the course of the night, although you can't rule out the odd rogue shower almost anywhere. But leaving behind those uh, wet roads and wet fields, and that's really good ingredients for it to turn misty and some fairly thick patches of fog by the end of the night. And a very warm night, a particularly sticky night again in the southeastern corner. Tomorrow then starts off grey and murky almost everywhere. Again, there could well still be some of those showery bursts of rain around. We will find that during the course of the day we'll have some showers breaking out. In the west, the showers fairly light and well scattered, quite different to today. But in the more central and eastern areas, there could well be some heavy and thundery showers coming along, more particularly in central and eastern parts of England, because that's where the highest temperatures are going to be. A very warm, sticky 28 degrees again. In the west, temperatures are uh, rather more pleasant. And then, as I hinted at the beginning, we will something, uh, see something of a change, I think, in the days ahead. It starts off fairly hot, but then we are going to see somewhat cooler and fresher weather moving across from the west during the next few days. So that on Friday, starting off fairly warm 